All right, we're gonna mount this mirror with a metal tab up here where the old one used to be. And if you can see, there's dried up stuff there that we gotta scrape off. I'm gonna use the JB mirror weld. First step is to mark the outside. Just so we know where to stick it. Next step is to scrape off any old stuff. There you go. Next step, I've gotten some 91% IPA and I'm gonna wipe and keep that nice and clean there. And same goes over here. Clean this up. In my case, I'm gonna mount it up a little bit higher because just the way the mirror I have, uh, the way it sits, it has to be mounted up a little bit higher. Apparently what you do is you snap the inside of this vial. That's the activator. And there you go. Basically that was pure white. And after I did this, it actually became uh, the blue color here. Then you apply this oil on top of that. and let that sit for one to two minutes. And after that's dried up for one to two minutes, <clears throat> apply some of this glue here. Just a single bead is apparently all you need. All you do now is apply that wherever it's supposed to. Like that. <sighs> Now, obviously I use too much. You just press and hold it for about a minute. Minute, but there's some excess here. I'm gonna just slowly remove that with my wipe here so it doesn't cause any problems later. Now this thing wants you to do it between 50 and 75 and uh, you want to wait a minimum of 30 minutes before you mount the mirror to the button. Now it's 51 degrees here, so I'm going to give it about an hour. All right, so everything went well, except one big mistake. I had that thing upside down. If you see, the narrow part with that arrow looking thing faces up. I had it backwards. And if you look at this picture here, they make it sound like that notch points down, but that notch, I don't know if you can see here. Yeah, that right there, and it's supposed to point up. Because the way I, I had it before, it did not work. With the way it is right now, the mirror angles are a lot better. So that's the only mistake I made. Luckily, I had just enough to do it one more time. There's the finished product with all the angles fixed up.